So right now we're at the storage unit. And we're about to get these art supplies. So yeah, let's get into it. I'm really excited. Uh, okay, there's two. There's two. I'm so glad you're here. My name's Alana and I'm an artist. I'm a creative individual. And in this video, as you saw by the title, I'm transforming this room into my own art studio, which is kind of insane, legally. Uh, I'm really happy with how it turned out. I spent about four days, give or take, kind of making it fully functional for me. So yeah. I want to keep this intro pretty short and sweet, but I'll probably be popping in every now and again to kind of narrate my process. Um, and that's about it. That's all I really got to say. Please grab a warm drink, a warm beverage, get cozied up because this is a cozy transformation here, and enjoy this video. Enjoy the music, enjoy the visuals, and yeah, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. I want to put up my Harry Potter stuff. This is the second to last day of me recording the studio transformation. Um, you know, I was really liking everything. I thought it was nice, I thought it was neat. But when I sat down to draw, I was not quite happy with the fact that I would have to like go through my drawers and find things that I wanted to use. And I'm like, girl, it's an art studio. You gotta, you gotta take your stuff out and have it, you know, visible, easy access. So later that day, I brought in this bookshelf that was in my room, and I filled it with all my paint and supplies, which I, first off, really enjoyed doing. Very satisfying. Um, but yeah, I just liked the look of it, and I liked how easy access everything was. So. I kind of did the same thing 